<sighs> Take three. <laughs> Every time I filmed, I got the boob nipple in there. <laughs> Again, I say it's Tuesday. And I hope she is going to take me to that new pancake place that opened up yesterday. Um, and it's a new day and a new month. It's March. See right there. Um, and I'm going to do laundry after I get back home today. So, fingers crossed on the... New pancake place. All right. <laughs> no boob nipple? No boob nipple. Father, her name was Hundumi. And when he told her, he says, Hundumi, I brought you some dates. He says, I want you to taste them and see if you like them. So she tasted them and she says, oh, they're delicious. Mm -hmm. So she says, I like them very much. So he looked at and her mother and father, and her mother said to her, Hundumi, you are engaged. You're going to marry him. His name is Bolus. 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 In, in, in English, that means Paul. So she didn't know. What? She says, I. She wrote my Eeyore email, but I was keeping it. Well, where are Bob's going? Well, let's go. Do you have Mama's or two? Yeah. Uh, not you, you're still working. How many people put together? Oh, come on, Mr. Pancake. What is it? Stuffed potato pancake. You need coffee? Uh, yes, I'll have coffee. Regular? Regular. Mm-hmm. This is stuffed potato pancakes. Look at it. Mm. 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 Looks good. to my brother all the time. He would chase me around and hit me with a tennis racket. As soon as my parents leave, you know, he would go in my room, grab my tennis racket, and whack the shit out of me. Oh, yeah, he, he was... My best friend in high school, her and her sister used to fight. i never seen siblings fight like this. I mean, it was bad. Like fist fighting? So we were in the living room one day, and we are drinking that red soda from the 80s. I can't remember what it's called. Tab? Oh, you know, I know. It red, is. Big red or something? Big red, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep. So... We're watching Dirty Dancing because we thought it was going to be something good, you know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, she comes in, you know, her sister only had like um, more or less just, she was born with. So, what all goes into this, these mega things? Collagen, lift off, which has extra B vitamins, ginseng, and ginkgo. Oh, okay. Um, Concentrate tea that goes in there, which has some caffeine, um, <laughs> and it 
helps boost your metabolism. Pickle cake, all right. I wonder what she'll say about that. She'll probably go, oh, you. <laughs>
I-21. Bingo! N-38. N-32. N-37. O-65. B-7. Round over. emails or any activity on her email accounts that gave us any clue on to her disappearance. Early November, police and volunteers combed a wooded area near Penn State University. No trace of Cindy Sloan. She had apparently vanished, leaving detectives with nothing to go on but hunches and theories. First, Cindy's state of mind. Had she become depressed and taken her own life? Friends say no way. They remember Cindy's upbeat mood on Halloween night. That's actually how Yep, it's tater tot again. No, I'm not getting sick of it. I love this stuff. I smashed the potatoes in my meal. And you know something? I am feeling a little bit on the tired side. But I did start module three textbook projects and I did like three pages of instructions. But um, soon I'm gonna go to bed after I'm done eating this because I am tired. And then I'll, uh, when I wake up, I will uh, do more. Because I don't want to get behind on my schedule with my class. You know, when this class ends, I still want to be up to date and working on everything. And then when it ends, it ends and I'll be done too. You know what I mean? So I hope this made sense to you. Generating further speculation, police have not located the stranded motorist Dale Williams went to help. Was a mystery caller a woman, as Dale's friend surmised? And why has that person never come forward? Well, there. Investigators may already have that answer. The purported distress call was placed from a stolen cell phone. Dale Williams' loved ones must also face yet another perplexing scenario. There are those who claim that Dale's truck was parked in his normal spot at his body shop by 1.30 p.m. the day he vanished. residential neighborhood was rocked by a powerful explosion. The force of the blast ripped through the roof of this ranch-style home, causing it to burst into flames. Firefighters quickly contained the swift-moving blaze, but not before much of the residence had been destroyed. The home was owned by Robert and...
that was a preview of uh, my next bubble level I am trying to beat. Previous clip there. It's hard. Hyperless video soon. I'll plug you in here. Alright, you guys. Hyperlapse time. It's still Tuesday night, and when you see the crack of dawn cut through like a light in the sky, it's a Wednesday then, the 2nd of March. So, yeah. Alright, so I'm all ready for bed. I'll, uh, see you in the a.m. Hmm. <sighs> This is a combination video, combined video, I mean, of Tuesday and Wednesday together. Oh, and did I tell you the bug guy is coming Thursday to lay chemicals or something like that. So, um, Kim is going to pick me up Thursday morning at nine and and then I think she's done with me at noon so maybe I'll be done with whatever it is at noon and then I'll be filming later on that day all right so uh, I'll see you around Ugh, I need to shower in the morning so gross yuck I had a little dandruffy, and I did make an eye appointment. It's for Friday at one Okay, something really strange happened. I was dreaming about the past and stuff. It was 1992, my mom's birthday. And it was like, I was like going through old pictures. And um, I saw dad, um, that he made a... Uh, fish and fries, I go, oh, it must be a Friday that day in 1992. And, you know, I just woke up 
and I confirmed it, I searched on my phone, May 29th, 1992, and it was a Friday. How weird is that? It could have been like a Sunday and we decided to fish fry or whatever. But oh my god. I would have never guessed. <laughs> that is like so weird. Okay, so I am up now. Um, what else was I going to tell you? I forgot to tell you that I uh, saw my score of, uh, my grade, excuse me, of my final project. And I'm going to show it to you from my screenshot, okay? Screen, um... Recorder thingy. Okay? Okay. Man, that was so weird. It could have been Sunday. could have been a Tuesday. That day in May, May 29th, 1992. And she wanted to fish and fries. Wow. That was like a random guess. Can't believe it. Okay. Screen recorder. Okay, see this? This also surprised me. I thought it would be like 130 out of 200 or whatever. So, yeah. <laughs> it is pretty high. 180 points out of 200 points. It's better than nothing, like I said. But yeah, um, I'm going to work on Excel again today, but I'm going to have something to eat here first, and, um, and it's online therapy today, I feel like I need a haircut, yuck, um, and you know, maybe I should also confirm with that, did we have fish and fries on mom's, um, birthday in 1992? Want me to film that? I, I'll just tell him I had a weird dream. Oh, I need to confirm this. I was looking at pictures in my dream and... Yeah, so... Alright. Hello? Dad, I was dreaming about something really weird. I was dreaming that I was going through old photographs. And, and I guess yes, you have a, yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I was, I, I guess it was a Friday because I saw you, um, that you made like fish fries. Uh-huh. And it was May 29th. Did you guys make fish and fries on May 29th, 1992? What year? 1992. 19 what? 92. 92, did I make a face? There you have it. <laughs> so, uh, uh, oops, Piglet, you dropped down, honey. Yeah. Hi, everybody. So, I am gonna, um, get myself dressed here. <sighs> and I will uh, shower later today. I feel like I need it. So. Mm -hmm. God, I hate these damn eye boogers. God, they're so annoying. Okay, um, see ya. Yeah, I edited it to, um, short. 
he said he couldn't uh, remember that far back. <laughs> And then he joked and said, if I remember, I'll let you know. <laughs> he can't remember back in 1992 if he made fish or fries or not. <laughs> I just re-listened to the clip and I'm like, oops, I shortened it too short. So, um, I'm going to finish going to the bathroom here and, uh, Find something to eat next. Same here. I can't remember my name or anything. Hmm. Amnesia. We both have amnesia. Amnesia. They are fabulous. I always wanted to have my memory erased. <sighs> so now what do we do? How am I supposed to know? Why, well, hey, you said grown up. I am? Five hundred. You only gave us like four hundred. So oh, capitalism, dear, is gonna tell us something for my trouble. We're causing the homeless. Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, come on, not hurt. Where did you get this? What is it, my aunt's coat today? Where did you get this coat? It belonged to her late aunt. Oh, crap. Mom, it's not how it looks, okay? Yes, we sold the stuff, but we sunk all the money back into buying clothes for the home. Yeah, we bought like five times as much clothes as we ever could have gotten. And you didn't keep anything for your... Hi, you guys. Um, I'm going to be ordering my food now. And he's going to pick me up at 1230. But I will have my phone here. Um, so... If you don't see me in the background or whatever, that's why. So, okay. Um, I tried to contact school, but uh, no one uh, picked up their phone. So, I'll just go tomorrow and hope for the best. Maybe somebody at the Epidemic Resource Center can help. If I'm having issues with something, but yeah, I'll be doing my Excel in between eating. I'm still a little hungry. It was like that little bit. Plus, I had kettle corn, so. All right. Better get on my shoes, too, because he's uh, coming at around like 12.15, I think. So, uh, yeah, this is going to be a really long video, I'm guessing, huh? Almost an hour, I bet, huh? <laughs> oh, well. I'll shower tonight before bed so that I uh, won't have to worry about waking up too early and then, yeah. But what can I wear? this, something like this. Alright. Hey, you'd be doing me a favor, actually. What do you mean? Well, I used to live here, right on this spot. There used to be a tree here, and I lived in it with my family. Now, some idiot knocked over these trees. I know my insurance doesn't cover that. I, I don't know where my family went. Look, just eat me and get it over with, will you? Oh, well, uh, that's healthy sporting of you there, uh... Arthur, Arthur Rizzi. Earl, Earl Sinclair. How you doing? Glad to know you. You know, I'm gonna let you know a little something there, Rizzi. You're really better off being rid of your family. Yeah? Oh, sure. Family's one of civilization's worst ideas. You support them, you give them all your money. You put food on the table? No offense there, Rizzi. It's none. And what do they do for you? They... Okay. Yeah, I was just updating my journal here. So this is, I'm going to save this for later. I'm going to put my pickle and lettuce and stuff in the burger and nuke it up. I'm going to just eat my uh, sweet potato fries for right now because I'm not all that hungry. I had my leftovers from yesterday, 
it was just 80 percent of it left so um i'm gonna just have my sweet potato fries right now i'm watching unsolved mysteries Spoke to her for a few seconds. She lifted her head up. She had one arm around it, his neck and had a hold of it and walked out with her. Detectives decided that it was time to have a little talk with Dennis Smith. Who was it you talked to? Old And you said the waitress or bartender? Yeah. Which is it? Hey, Probably both of them at this point. Right. So, I mean, would laugh at times for no real apparent reason, which is very indicative. Emergency room reports, police reports. Well, the court doesn't see it quite that way. They gave him two years probation and he has to attend group therapy. Two years probation? He'll probably be out today. He'll do it again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know. Mm -hmm. This paper provides documentation that you can have your husband arrested. <laughs> You can use Excel's autofill feature to generate a sales forecast based on current trends or calculate the raise you need every year to reach your salary goal. Click and drag to select range B5. Using a formula with relative cell references helps you reduce work by saving keystrokes. When you copy that formula to a new cell, Excel adjusts the formula to perform the same calculation on other cells without retyping. Click cell B7. Type equal sign B5 minus sign B6 in cell B7 and press enter. Your formula will calculate the gross profit for year 20. So,
Aren't you going to invite me in? I'm sorry. If you're making a delivery, go to the service entrance. No autographs or pictures, please. And if you haven't announced yourself at the gate, I must ask you to leave. I am. Whew. Hi, guys. I just stepped out of the shower because um, I'm going to start an early morning, like at 8, 8 ish, or 8 30. Um, Kim is picking me up at 9. So, yeah, I'm going to dry my ears now, dry off, and I'm actually going to wear a nightshirt to bed. <clears throat> so, yeah, that's what time it is, and that's how dark it is out there. So... All right, I will uh, catch you all later. Toiletries one could find on a big boat in the middle of the ocean. The fancy restrooms were stocked with high-end Vinolia toilet soap. Vinolia toilet soap was marketed as Vinolia Otto and made special mention of its status as the Titanic soap of choice. It has some choice advertisement copy, too, telling buyers it's perfect for sensitive skin and delicate complexions and represents the highest standard of toilet luxury and comfort at sea. Hmm, 
not as catchy as you're not fully clean until your zip's fully clean, but we'll take it. While the first class had to scrub themselves with fancy soaps, the restrooms for the third class passengers were a little bit different. It wasn't Nipsey and in the night shirt. I'm over it, it says. Eeyore. It's an E boy. So. I'll show you in a minute here. And I had it on before. And I'm going to brush my teeth now. And I did set my alarm for eight, so. That would have me enough time to poop if I need to. Sorry about the TMI. Okie dokie, I'm going to grab Piglet. My hand sanitizer and a Kleenex box. Pillows right there. read for a little bit before bed too guys so I'm a little thirsty Alright, um, sorry again if this is a long video, like about almost an hour, or is an hour, but you know, I guess I have a lot of, to say about things. I got upset again over Excel. I just, I don't know if it's the program system itself, but it's not registering. It says to hit this dialog box and it and I click on it like it says to do and the menu won't pop up so I'm going to share that with the disability lady have her help me with that in the column widths to uh, the textbook project in module 3 and I was confused with that my therapist was confused about that because it doesn't look right versus the diagram picture so I don't know what I'm doing <laughs> so
so all right so um i'll see you all later maybe tomorrow if i feel like filming tomorrow but i don't know all righty so see you around yes i filmed myself eating chili there a year or so ago but you know it's just me eating chili i mean come on you see me eating like a hundred thousand times well, I miss it again, okay? Alright, I'm gonna put more water in this and um, get going to bed here. I wake, I wake up at 8. I set it for 8.09.